Okay, Jenica and Maria, can you explain to me what is neurogenic yoga? Yeah, so neurogenic yoga is a method that includes yoga postures, yoga breath, body-driven movement that actually is designed to elicit the body's natural shaking response. While in neurogenic yoga, we use different kinds of yoga, so it can really be married with any kind of yoga, not the specific style. And what value does this tremor mechanism have in the yoga experience? Well, I think as we're looking at how the yoga world is expanding and what it's including, one of the things we're seeing is trauma-sensitive yoga. And so what I'm finding is so interesting about what we're doing is that we're, we're taking this idea of tra trauma-sensitive yoga and actually making it trauma-knowledgeable yoga. And this is kind of the next step to me. You know, it's like trauma sensitivity is the least we can do as yoga practitioners. Um, so what's the next step? It's really taking us into trauma knowledge as practitioners in yoga. Okay, so as you know, the trauma mechanism is a very powerful releasing modality. So combined, so the two different things that they are going in the same direction combined, they are really becoming exponentially more powerful and this is the feedback that i get from a lot of people that are familiar with tre and that are not or they are familiar with yoga but they find that the the combination of the two becomes more powerful and effective if i was going to come to you to study neurogenic yoga why would i do it and what should i expect in the training program Beautiful. Yeah, so this program is a dual certification, which means that you're getting certified in tension and trauma releasing exercises and also neurogenic yoga. So practitioners that come through the program actually are going to be able to teach and facilitate both of these. And so for, for a person that's interested in coming to get certification, what you're going to be looking at is a really integrative process where you're bringing your yoga knowledge, what you're already doing, what you already love about yoga, uh, and integrating it with this really powerful release work. And it's a really beautiful unfolding of who you are as a human being and also who you are as a facilitator. One clarification is in order to join in this program, you already have to be a yoga teacher for a little while. So while TRE is open to the TRE Global Certification Program is open to anyone who is interested for themselves and to be certified to teach others, this dual program is only open to people that already have been teaching yoga for a while and they're certified in yoga because we don't want to teach them how to teach yoga. We want to teach them how to integrate what they already know with the tremor mechanism. From your experiences of teaching neurogenic yoga for years now, what have been some of the consistent reports that people have given back to you, either as yoga trainers or as just practitioners of neurogenic yoga, that would give us some evidence suggesting how important it is to combine the tremor mechanism with the yoga practice? Yeah, I mean, listen, we're all walking around with uh, stress, some level of upregulation in our nervous systems, um, trauma patterns that we're dealing with and actually are impeding our way of, of being uh, in our wholeness, in our fullness. And so what I'm noticing so much about, especially our, our trainees in our program, uh, as they're learning how to integrate this into their own lives, what they're finding is that it's it's changing them at every level. It's changing how they're it, how they're showing up in their relationships, their bodies. Uh, they, they're longtime yoga practitioners who still have aches and pains and injuries that are speaking to them, and they're resolving these patterns within a few months of practicing neurogenic yoga because it's adding this extra element of actually getting down to releasing these tension patterns. So physical um, shifts in the body, um, being able to be in relationship more effectively, having a deeper relationship with themselves, uh, and really then integrating this into their classes has taken their practice, their, their practitioner work as yoga facilitators into a completely new realm um, that really ups their game as a yoga practitioner. Well, as I said, when I started teaching neurogenic yoga around the world, um, it was interesting to expose different culture to it too, and the feedback was unanimous. This works better, and better. defining better is like it goes deeper, 
I have, I feel more relaxed. I tremor more. I tremor in a different way that seems to be more really in the core of my body. What I know about people in this, um, in this population is that they love to keep growing and learning themselves. So yes, they're looking to be able to integrate something new into their work, but they're really looking for how, how is this going to change me and what, do, what can I do for myself? So I think what's so beautiful about this program that we've created is that yes, you're going to get certified in these, in these two great methods. And by the way, it's really wonderful to, to have both on board. Um, because not everybody is going to be really drawn to yoga and not everybody is going to be drawn to just the exercises. So you'll have both. Uh, but what I'm, what I'm inviting people into is, is that this program isn't just learn how to facilitate something. This program is incredibly expansive for the practitioner working with themselves, expanding their own experience releasing their own tension patterns, learning how yoga and the body and trauma really um, are so interwoven. Uh, and it's a really unique experience. This program is a very unique program. I don't know any others like it. You know, no matter if you're doing this for professional reason or for personal reason, you have to take it as a personal journey. If people go through, they will have to change. Something in them will change. and. And that's really the most beautiful thing. I mean, it's very exciting to teach this work. So, so one of the other benefits I think about this training is not just what you get face to face, uh, but what we've gotten really good at as seeing who you are as a facilitator, like who, who is this, this trainee that's coming in that wants to be a teacher and really seeing like, where are the strengths, where is the work need, where does the work need to be to make you the best facilitator? that you could possibly be, not just as a neurogenic yoga and TRE facilitator, but as a facilitator of any work, as a person that's in the world sharing um, practices like this, as the person that's um, you know, going to the grocery store and speaking to the person that's check it, checking them out you know, at, their, at the grocery line. Um, I think we're, we're really doing a fabulous job at honing in on who you wanna be as a, as a facilitator and helping you get there. And also who you want to be as a person, you know, because frankly, uh, this is the, you know, we, we, I would like to change the world, but I'm really very aware that all I can change is myself, you know, so, and if I do that, however, there will be a repercussion that like a, the, the proverbial, you know, when you throw a stone in the pond, it keeps suspending. And I see it around me. I see it, you know, we are making a difference, David. We mean you and all of us around you. We are making a difference. It's happening.